How's that crowd? You can already hear them. They're pretty hyped up. Thursday night, it's going to be a good Thursday night. This is Magic Mike Live, based on the movies starring Channing Tatum. To perform in the cast, it takes more than being a great dancer and having a body that gets a reaction like this. Our Magic Mike Live venue is a 360 immersive experience. No matter where you're sitting, there's gonna be a dancer interacting with you. One of the unseen elements of being a performer in the show is being able to read the body language of audience members. Not everybody wants to be involved, so we look for cast members that can adjust to people who want to be on stage, all the way down to people who want to merely watch. In this scene, two audience members have been brought on stage for a dance. Before proceeding with the routine, the performer asks the audience member for consent. So during the show, we have a safe word. The safe word is unicorn. And if the lady says unicorn, we'll stop whatever we are doing. During rehearsals, the cast and crew play the role of audience members for scenes where there's interaction. Like in this number, where the cast picks audience members to join them in a partner dance. If you go up to a girl and she is like, then we just go, okay. Maybe you'll just touch their hand and say, thanks for coming to the show and move on. If you scream loud enough, they take off their pants. Is this a strip show? It's a strip show in the sense that it is on the strip. I think most people, when they think Magic Mike Live, they think of some of the other male review shows, but it's on a completely different level. The cast performs up to eight shows a week at Sahara Las Vegas. On some days, it's two shows in one night, each with 16 different dance numbers, as well as rehearsals. It looks so awesome because it's totally your flavor and it's got your energy. The cast doesn't just learn their own choreography. Each cast member is expected to cover two or three roles or tracks in addition to their primary role. I want to see like how you're going to do it for real. For each track in the show, there has to be at least one performer who can swing or cover for that role. What's your name? Mike, that's convenient. My name is Ryan Carlson. I play Magic Mike in Magic Mike Live. There are two cast members who can cover the Magic Mike track. At this rehearsal, Carlson shadows one of them, cast member Shane Bruce, who along with cast member Patrick Packing must always be ready to cover the role of Mike. Each number has a different dance style that cast members must master. I'm a ballet dancer first, and I'm here doing a strip slash dancing show. It's a very out of my element. There's every style you can imagine, including breaking. We do hip hop, we dance in the water. Then you have someone like Jackson. He is our aerial specialist in the show. Aerial is something that I had never done before. Literally a week before I flew over from London, they were like, hey, how's your aerial skills? And I was a bit like, what, you know? Oh, can you get your hands ready? We use this for our hands. What is it? Rosin. Uh, rosin, okay. What yes. does that do? It just basically gives you grip. Shoulders is really important. So, it's a massive factor, shoulders and grip. This is our stretch area. It's also a place that we can get ready for the show, uh, lift up some weights, warm up the areas that need to be warmed up. Obviously, with being in the show, fitness is a big part of it. Personally, I train about five times a week in the gym. Big shoulders. Look at them. Oh my god, I can see them. Are you going to do more headstands? <laughs> you want to keep your body flexible, so a mixture of heavy weight training and light body weight. With up to eight performances a week, the cast doesn't have much time to recover from the physical demands of the show before the cycle starts again. How do you recover uh, after 
for a show. Lately, we've been doing ice baths. <laughs> and when there's half an hour in between each show, you know, it takes its toll. According to an industry source, full-time Magic Mike live performers can make between about $54,000 and $91,000 per year plus benefits. About 75% of the show's cast members have been with the production since it debuted in 2017. That's crazy how little turnover there is. Why is that? Because the show's up. Yeah, it's a good day. Since we've been dancing together for so long, it's just the, the brothers and the homies. Like, you, right. you like coming to work because your friends are at work. I think a lot of the time when you're performing, you basically want some kind of reaction. <laughs> I'd be worried if that wasn't. When all the boys, 13 of you, are standing there and then you all start taking your tops off, there's always a reaction and it's electrifying. You end up dancing harder, performing harder. That's between just the boys. <laughs> That's not just for the audience. The boys are hype jacked. And then you, you remember how much you love your job. Like we love our job.